a Pac-Man shaped ukulele, and a heavy metal t-shirt. It's episode 13 of Loot. This is a ticking time bomb. The longer you wait, the more pieces will wind up soggy. Except, with the O-Bowl, you decide what pieces get wet and when. And these wine glasses let you control wet stuff musically. The markings on the side tell you where to fill for a specific note when running your finger over the rim. Luna and Curious offer Bonnie tights with a hidden gun and socks that make you look like a duck. But for you men, if you want to look classy and upcycled, check out these ties. They're made out of wood from demolished barns. They're also a perfect companion to these no-wash underpants. The front's yellow, the back's brown, no worries. But if you do plan on practicing some hygiene, do it in the dark with this glow-in-the-dark toilet paper from Firebox. Now, if things get smelly, but you want to maintain manliness, use a man can. These candles smell like bacon, sawdust, New York-style pizza, a new leather baseball mitt, and more. Okay, the classic Coca-Cola bottle shape? Please, I prefer the original Hutchinson can. As part of their 125th anniversary, you can own the bottle's entire history. Now, if you like heat and sweet, drizzle spicy chili pepper-infused hot honey on your pizza. They even say it goes well in tea. Stay fancy with Think Geek's science jewelry, a pendant that also is a functioning sundial, and this 8-bit hair bow. Then play a game of poker with some toast playing cards. The jokers are eaten and burnt. Japan Trend Shop also carries this desk lamp suspended by its spill. Then relax in a replica Big Lebowski The Dude cardigan. The one used in the movie auctioned for more than $10,000, but now the company that originally made it is offering a replica for $188. You can wear it and lounge around listening to your iPhone or iPod in a nice loud gramophone station. Not sticky enough? Well, try out Nito Shop's phone stand that looks like bubblegum. And be sure to use the Kick to Pick app that balances on a pregnant belly, cycles through possible baby names, and uses the phone's accelerometer to detect baby kicks so that your baby can choose its own name before it's even born. Transfer files with these fried shrimp USB memory sticks or a super slim bookmark that is also a 2GB flash drive. Now it's time for something free. The font that Coca-Cola is written in. It's just the way people used to be taught how to do cursive back at the turn of the century. It's called Spencerian handwriting and it was replaced later on by the Palmer method, which for instance Mickey Mantle used, and today we learned the Danielian method. But anyway, what that means is that Coca-Cola obviously owns the trademark for their brand name, Coca-Cola, but they don't own the copyright on the specific script it's written. I mean, for crying out loud, the Ford Motor Company uses the same script. So there you go. Have fun using your free public domain ancient cursive style, and as always, thanks for watching.